Hey guys, it's Fox with Foxy Games, and by popular request, I'm going to show you how to make Mugicha, which is Japanese barley tea. This is one of the more popular brands, it's called Marubishi. It's Mugicha designed to be placed in cold water and brewed entirely in cold water. It is the world's easiest tea to make. So let's take a look at the packaging. Looks beautiful, it's got lots of moon language on it, otherwise known as Japanese. Simple instructions below, put tea packets in water, put in fridge. That's it. Ignore this bottom set, we're not going to do that. This is what we're going to do. So let's take a look at what we got inside. Open the package up, pull out the tea bags, and you'll notice that there's two connected together. Go ahead and leave them like that. That's the way we want to roll. You're going to put both of these in a single pitcher of water. So let's do it. Basically, get yourself some cold water. Mine comes from a metallic device known as a faucet. Fill it on up and drop those two tea bags in it. It doesn't get much simpler than that, guys. This is what they look like. Pop it in there. Make sure the water pressure isn't too high, otherwise you could actually damage the cheese grating or that cheese paper, whatever it's called, around the tea bags. You don't want to break it open. Fill it up to the top, and that's pretty much it. Like I said, guys, world's easiest tea to make. Now, go ahead and pop it in your fridge and leave it there for about 50 minutes to an hour, and you're good to go. Longer to make it stronger. And yeah, what did I tell you guys? It is the world's simplest tea to make. Pour it over a tall glass of ice and you've got yourself some delicious cold mugi cha. Japanese roasted barley tea. Really, it doesn't get easier than that. Thanks to Marubishi and mugi cha. So let's go ahead and try some and see what it tastes like. I already know, but I'm just doing it for you. Mmm, that's delicious. Mugi cha. It's great. And I hope you try it. Let me know in the comments below what you think of Mugi Chao.